and it ain't even dinner time and I just had a piece of chocolate cake. My goodness, brother. It was warmed up in the microwave for 12 seconds. Room temp, 12 seconds. My goodness, that icing was just starting to melt. It was creamy and luxurious. The actual cake itself feels so good. Oh shit, it ain't even dinner, bro. Um, so I'm in a good mood. I'm in a good mood. I got a lot of dope. Got a lot of dopamine flowing after that one. And um, we're playing the Players Championship at TPC Sawgrass. How you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Thanks. Uh, thanks for watching. PGA Tour 2K23. We're about to do the damn thing. Yesterday we um, got my first ace. First ace. All in one. Did that. If you didn't watch the video, I ah, ruined it for you now. But go check. I think it was on the 17th hole. Sick. Absolutely sick. We'll see if we can do it again. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling very unstressed right now, which is a good place to be mentally going into a round of golf. You know what I mean? You gotta be, you gotta be, you gotta be okay here if you wanna, you know, get it out there. And I wanna get it out there. What I really want is the screen to, what the fuck? What happened? I broke something? I think I fucked something up. Oh yeah, something froze. Oh, oh. Okay, we're here. PGA Tour, proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Yeah. Today's coverage of the Players Championship. The Players Championship. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Rich Beam in the booth, and it's a hello to Henny. Look at that! Look at that! TPC Sawgrass. I'm ready to play. Last time I hit on 17 at Sawgrass, I completely screwed it up. But um, I can do it this time. Dude, golf games are amazing. Look at how beautiful this hole is. So it looks like they're trying to beat Morikawa this week. That's ambitious. Seems like a friendly duel from the outside, but could create some extra sparks today. <laughs> I almost just I'm away for them to stop talking again. Like they're going to beat Colin Morikawa. Does that even happen these days? He's one of the most consistent players on tour. I don't know that he's beatable. Well, it's been accused of having a balky putter occasionally, but you're right. Iron players good as Tiger Woods in his prime. Uh, the short game's irresistible, but I think the most impressive thing about young Colin is his mindset. He's got a 40-year-old mind on a 20-year-old body. No wonder he's winning at a decent rate of knots. Okay, they're done talking. Now we can play. <clears throat> Gonna have to get my timing right. I did not hit the driving range before this uh, episode. Oh my god. Okay, that was terrible. That was the worst thing I think I've ever done. Well, this is some but I did not end up in the water. The tournament coming off a last start win, Rich. Can't think of any better momentum. Obviously, the players firing on all cylinders. Sit back, watch, and enjoy it. Can't tell. I mean, clearly it's going to come off right here. I just, I can't get the timing. I mean, that was a decent shot. I should have warmed up. <clears throat> I definitely should have warmed up. Out of the bunker and onto the green, but still a fair bit of effort to go here. Putting for birdie. Let's go about 70 feet. What do you say? What do you say? What do you s Oh my god. Almost got done. This is important. Big par putt here. Okay. Uh, so my first two shots. Um, terrible. Probably the worst three-click shots I've ever hit. Second par five. Driver Let's not try this again. Necessarily required here because you have to shape your tee shot from right to left, and if you're a right doom, man a golfer, doom, doom, that's not the easiest doom, thing to do. So doom, lefties doom, have a better doom, opportunity, doom, I think, of finding doom. this fairway than most with driver. 
From there, a second shot over a long bunker to a green that's very narrow, dotted by pot bunkers. Truly is one of the coolest par fives on this layout. Cool. Par five. There we go. Doom, doom, doom. Now I got it. Now I got it. <clears throat> For this green into Rich, it's an exciting but daunting task. The green is minuscule from back in the fairway. You know that you have a little bit room over to the left, but you're going to fall off into a low area. And if you miss it out to the right, you're going to find a very deep bunker on the right hand side of the green. I'm not really no great miss around here, but if you're going to go for it, you have to know that your short game is going to bail you out no matter where you miss it. Heard that. I'm hoping that wind kind of blows us back towards the hole here. Oh, buddy. The hybrid. Oh, buddy. Headed left. Yep. <clears throat> That's okay. Not able to find the green in. That's okay. But a bold play. Close to the surface here. The green side rough. Getting 93%. Come on back, right? Come on back, right? Might have went a little bit little chip. Love too far the left. Around the greens. Okay. Us. We'll take a bird. We will take a bird. To Colin Morikawa. He's one stroke behind what do you do? His this is for par? Oh, what brother. And look out, guys. This Every time. What is it? Like, who programmed the game to be that way? They are always, like, in the bunker or in the rough for par, and they always hit it in. It doesn't make sense. Why is that, like, always the case? Such a cool little par three. Love this green. There's a low section in the front and a high section in the back. And anytime they put the pin all the way in the back section of the screen, well, I tell you what, good luck on you. If you miss this green long and or left, that bunker sits some it's pretty good shot below the surface of the green. It's a pretty good shot for us right there. Attacking the flag stick. Bite. Okay. Bad play, that one. This one here. This is for back to back birdies moving him in the right direction. I think we're putting this one slightly downhill. So let's take a little bit off of it. I kind of like that putt. It's got a chance. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. That's back Come on. Back birdies. Back Come on. Back birdies moving the right direction. Back back birds. He's currently tied for chasing. Always like to see Woon Kim moving up the leaderboard. Never a bad thing. I think just a nice little layup here. Get that wind to bring it back a little bit. Yeah, that's a nice shot. A nice shot for us. Quality shot that one. Henny, what's the player facing here? Yeah, he's looking at maybe a little over 130 to the pin. Just don't know if I want a pitch shot. I kind of like the idea of. This is just not going to give us quite enough, I don't think. That seven mile an hour wind is pretty ferocious. I need... I need like 135. Maybe like 130. All right, we'll just try this. Now, honestly, if we keep the roll on it, we might be okay here. We might be okay. We might be okay with that. Come on. Give me a bounce. Yeah. Okay. Didn't roll as much as I thought. Absolutely. That was the right club, though. That, one. Colin Morikawa that was definitely the right club. To be the original and best approach player, but I think we have a new sheriff in town. You spoke too soon, lady. My goodness. Okay, so if he doesn't birdie that hole, we know that the replays are bugged. Yeah, he's staring down about 12 feet. He's staring down a birdie putt here. Shh. 
surely it's going to. Yeah. And down it goes. Damn right it is. This man's marching into the top. Damn right it is. Colin Marcat, like he somehow missed that putt. It just doesn't make sense. They gotta work on that, bro. Strong hole this one, isn't it? Six mile an hour winds. Left hand side that you want to avoid at all costs. The bunker down the right hand side, to be fair, is not that bad. But a little further right of that, though, that's the water. You want no part of it. Second shot Boom. is downhill to a green. To be fair, that's mostly flat, runs from back left to front right, but one of the more benign greens on this layout. Five mile an hour winds. Honestly, it might just be right here. It might just be straight at that bitch. I tried to bring it back. Right, because I knew I was uh, I was late. That screwed up our power a little bit. Hey, we still ended up on the green though. Within their comfort zone there. Not bad. Let's see if we can make this big putt for birdie. Is it really that far uphill? Jesus. I feel like I'm about to smack the hell out of this. Damn, I did need a little bit more. I know it didn't go down. But it just a tap in awaits. <clears throat> Our current leader is a one shot lead. We'll take that. All right. Four, six, four mile an hour wins. Let's just smoke it. Taken out of the way, Rich. But uh, what do you think of this short path? I missed the tree. I thought Come on back. Was a really cool feature of Come on back. I had to flight it yeah. underneath the tree back in the day. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Look at this crater. Has been expanded quite a bit as the lake on the left hand side has been added as well. The front part of this green is protected by tall palm trees that will certainly make you think on your second shots. This is a wonderful little par four. You say so, buddy. It's going to be a little left. Not the worst shot, though. I admire that talent. Just green after green in <clears throat> Not the worst. Colin Morikawa setting up his shot. I am like so much better with the three click, <laughs> which I know it's supposed to be much easier. Okay, let's get. But like, it just makes the game more fun. You know what I mean? Trying to get. Not every game I get on to play, am I looking for the most ultimate challenge? Like, things have changed. Sometimes I just, when I get on and just hit a fucking ball straight. You know what I'm saying? And the three click just allows me to do that. An opportunity to make a At least straighter. And down it goes. Still only came away with a par. Look at that clubhouse. Three under overall. Imagine that was your crib. Yeah, damn. As we go from a wonderful little par four, we go to a challenging longer par four, the seven. And as you can see, there's a long fairway bunker down the left hand side that makes you believe there's more room <laughs> left than you actually have. It's just not there. Players should be looking a little bit further right. If you yep. find the fairway, your second shot should be straightforward. In fact, Luke. I made a two here one time, so that shows you how simple this hole can be. Don't believe that. Well, I started that one left, but heading straight towards the cut stuff. Brought it back to the right. This shot is about 140 yards out. He's right in the hunt, just a shot off the pace. Ball's gonna come off a bit right, but the wind, honestly, you should bring it back. And then we're gonna put no roll on it. Honestly, I like, I like the flag stick here. I like just hitting it right here. I think this is the shot, if I put a good swing on it. It's not the worst. It's not the best either, though. Yeah. Getting the timing on that front part is just killing me today, man. Now let's switch out. Normally, I'm. To Colin Morikawa. He's Normally, I'm better. His rival. Let's see what happens here. Ooh, wow. He hit the stick. The Gary Player highlight reel. Here's we hit the stick with it. Move into a share of top spot on the leaderboard. This is for a share of the lead.
Get there. That was a oh. attempt. And that should secure the par on this one. <clears throat> a stroke after that hole. Where are we at? Tied for third? The eighth hole, a long par three, stretching 240 yards at its maximum. Damn! And it's no sleeper, that's for sure. I don't find anything sleepy about this hole. The front of this green is so narrow. There's no place to land it, especially when they put the flag stick there. This hole will grab your attention, as it should, because it's a long iron to a sliver of an opening. Even when they put the pin on the right-hand side, you want no part of it. The center of the green all day long here. Here we go. What do you say? They've got the five wood. What do you say with that one? Two aces in a row? Come on. Give me a bounce. Give me a roll. Give me a roll. I'll never get another hole in one. There's no way. 13 feet to the hole. It just ain't no way, boy. I don't think I put enough brake on that. Just didn't drop. Or I put too much. For a par now. He kept his shares for <clears> position. <throat> All right, we're still close. The Hanging in there. The opening nine at TPC Sawgrass. Par five. Medium course, Rich is a clever three shotter. Par five, five hundred and eighty-three yards. Uh oh. Most uh oh. We'll play this as a three shotter. Just find the fairway out to the left. Second shot out. Okay, we're clear of the water. We're clear of the water. That's that's what I was afraid of. Narrow green. Miss it right or left. Good luck getting it up and down. This is this second shot? Well, come on then. Yeah, good ball, fucker. Okay. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Can't lie. And he has that ball line. Yeah, this is sitting up nicely. It's not going to cause any troubles. 91 to 94%. Um, damn, did he make it up on the green? I'll fucking go for it. I will go for it. Fuck it. Come on! Uh-oh. Good bounce. Oh, great bounce. Oh, come on. That's golf clappable. Come on. That's golf clappable. What a sensational play. I'm taking that all day. Stepped up their game. A bold play. Hopefully a bold reward. I'm going to actually not leave it short here. Make sure I get it up there. Oh my goodness. Good speed. Opportunity here to move into a tie for first. Good speed. I just can't quite punch it through. Oh, that was a birdie though. That was a birdie. Players stepping up, getting the best out of the games. It'll be interesting to see exactly who's going to be ahead at the end of the tournament. Striped that one. Oh, beauty ball. That was a beauty. Put themselves right back in position to win straight off their last start. They're going to have to make some birdies coming down the closing stretch, but they have a lot of good vibes coming from that last win. I expect more of the same this week. Yes, sir. Give me that. Pitching wedge here. Give me that. Give me a little bit of roll. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. That was straight off a replay. Three feet to the cup. This for a birdie birdie run. Thought I missed it. <laughs> okay, that was a sick shot. <clears throat> I'll take that one. Coming off a drop shot on that last hole. Mm. Lovely touch. Well played. You better believe it is great stuff to watch. All right, where did Garrick Higo come from? He's hanging in there with us. On this course, and the eleventh is certainly one of those. But uh, there are some troublesome spots if you get out of play. 
there definitely is trouble, but the thing I love about yeah. Luke is Four. so many different. Oh, we might get a good bounce. Play Most players will take nope. driver off Shit. the tee, but from there, now it's a ball game. You don't have to go for the off the pine straw. You can lay it up over the left. You can lay it up over to the right. You can lay it up long left. There's so many different ways of attacking this hole. Each individual is going to do it differently. I love the second shot on this hole. Few players in the history of the game have had a bigger impact so early in their career. Well, just keep talking then. Uh, some comparisons go as close to Tiger Woods. As they should be currently right now with what he has done in the game so far in his young career. He's come out each and every week and put pressure on every single player because of his ball striking and because they know that there's no weaknesses in his game other than sometimes the putter, but when you hit it as good as he does, you're bound to make a putt now and again. And each and every week when he shows up, players on the driving range are looking at him going, okay, he's here, I gotta have my A game. Certainly feels like sky's the limit for Colin Morikawa. Two major championships under his belt right now, surely more in his future. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna gargle his nuts anymore? What about Willie J? I'm leading the fucking FedEx Cup by a thousand, asshole. Suck my ass. Watch this one. Well, with a pocket Take that. FedEx Cup points over the last half a dozen starts or so, this player certainly has been delivering now they're, consistent results. Now they're talking about it. Wins or winning, Rich. Do you expect that to continue here this week? Without a doubt, the best player all around on tour in Thanks. my mind's eye it's Thanks. no shock to see them contending for the lead once again i appreciate you saying that <clears throat> give me a little bit of roll just a little bit of roll yep yep not bad thanks putting for birdie here hang on this looks pretty handy and that part will give them is that the lead? Six on the day. And that I'm six under. Six under par. Dude, Garrick Higo. I feel like the AI just, they keep one person just staying with you so you don't run away with it. On the short par 4 12th, most players can reach the green. It's just the decision whether the player goes for it or not. They can, but they better be aware that... Go for it on the drive? Their water left obviously is no good, but even bailing out to the right in those dunes in the mounds and little pot bunkers on top of those mounds well forget about it that's not a good space either especially since the green does run pretty hard from right to left <clears throat> you want to take this hole on with driver and expecting to make three hey, hey, damn. To realize that a five and a six could be easily made as well I just feel like it's going to be easier for me to put this Get it up that hill. Oh, no. Okay, I'll well, take that considering. Booty, but a part never hurts. Luke, as fast as I was traveling, I'm not too sure anything would have slowed that thing. Down. What? Flag stick. A bogey putter waits. Oh no, dude! Focus to Colin Morikawa. How did that not go in? I thought we'd see this. He is behind his rival. Can he do the? How did that not go in? <laughs> oh no, I suck. Well, as you start to head for home here at TPC Sawgrass, you're blessed with this wonderful par three thirteen. And this is a really cool par three. You've got three distinct areas on the green, front right, all the way on the left-hand side, and the back right. Wherever they put the pin is I don't want to miss this one short. what shot shape you want to have into that green. I think it's a really cool design because it requires you to think about how you want the golf ball to land on the green and the way you want it to bounce. Yep. Pete Dye did a great job in designing this green. Pretty good shot on that. With the eight iron here. Oh, I like that strike. This one's well, I'm glad I clubbed up. That was the right club. Just uh, okay, that'll work. Wind played a little bit more of a role and than I thought. He's currently Typical. His rival Typical of me. This is for par. 
Nazi class. Oh, yeah! You deserve that. Wait, did that ball just disappear? What are we looking at for this part, Henny? Did they let him have that? Focus on hitting the back there ain't no way, dog. This is up the hill, but if extra juice needed. Oh, come on in. Oh. Good line. Didn't see because my big ass head was in the way. <clears throat> Let's head to the next. That one's in there. Currently five under for the round. Pretty sure Markawa was what did I just say? One over? Here on the second nine at TPC Sawgrass, but it really sucks to suck, buddy. But up down the stretch, starting here with a difficult par four fourteen. Difficult tee shot on this plank, some four hundred and eighty one yards from the tip. You find the fairway, and you've got a Found decent it. chance of finding the green with your second shot. But if you're out of position anywhere on this hole, your number will go up exponentially. Not a bad shot out of us. Come on, get a good bounce to the left. Come on. <sighs> mm, that's right out of the copy book. It was just slightly late. Ooh, a 12 footer. Love to make a few of these today. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. Get in the hole! <sighs> That's frustrating. You know, Luke Donald once made all 400 plus attempts inside three feet on the PGA Tour. The leader now has a one stroke advantage. Damn! He's seven under now? The par four Who is this guy? Requires another strong tee shot because there's some trees in the way, Rich. Yeah, I see that. Do hit through a shoot off this tee shot, which makes it a little bit simpler, I believe, for the players. Bunker down the right hand side is no good <clears> because <throat> you'll have trees blocking you out with your second shot. If you miss it left into the pine straw, now you've got some trees blocking you out there. So finding the fairway is imperative. Okay. This green is no fun. You find the center of the green, and you might be able to putt every single day. But in all reality, you have to find the correct section in order to give yourself the best look at making a putt. Heard that. All I know is doom, doom, doom. Beautiful swing there. Thanks. Second shot here on the 15th. Five mile per hour winds. Thinking, thinking something like that. Maybe even less. Something like that. Right there. Now let that wind bring it over. Bring it over left. Bring it left. This one's heading up onto the green for sure. God. Thought I was gonna get a little bit, a little bit more help. Just a couple yards more. Now let's switch our focus to Colin Morikawa. Now who'd have thought we'd see this? He is behind his rival. Can he do the catching up that's necessary? Let's get back to it, shall we? It's a good shot. It's a good shot out of him. Well, Rich, think they can make this one? Look, I gotta say, I'm really not liking their chances here, but you never know. Stranger things have happened. Stranger things, indeed. Dude, I've been not putting enough break on it, so that time I went a little bit extra and I put too much. What are you gonna freaking do? Read each putt independently of the last? Not me. Not me, dog. You're going to put your foot down. This is as good a time as any. If there's one thing I'm good at with the three click, it's if I go late, I can purposely go late on the other one just to fix it. You know what I mean? Because if you get it wrong, I'm pretty good at that. You'll find out in a hurry with this second shot here at 16. Yeah, this is terrifying. The drink, you miss it left. You're going to be in some mounds. You can catch a nasty lie. And that's not any place you want to be it really is a difficult shot from over on the left hand side one of the most underrated difficult shots on this golf course however you're brave find the center of the green make eagle well life's good life is good let's fucking do it 
Come on. Be good. With the five wood. Be good. Right at the stick. Right at the stick. Oh, slow, slow. Oh, I like the courage here, Rich, getting after this par five in two. Oh, man, that's makeable. What a play. Hopefully, they'll reward it for that play. That is makeable, isn't it? Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah! Big putt like that. Let's go, man. Double, double circle. Give me that double circle. Just one off the lead after that hole. That was sick, dude. Garrick Hicko is a god. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is it. This is where I absolutely choked last time I played this hole. When you play here in a practice round, it looks like you could just throw it on there. But when you're in a tournament round, it doesn't even look like it exists. It, the hole changes so much when the tournament starts. That's what I love about it. You just add 35,000 people who are having some fun and ready to heckle you if you knock it in the water. Eh, good luck. Enjoy. Thanks. Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, great rhythm on that swing. Yeah, that's not bad. Bite. Bite. Yeah, we'll take that. Much, much better than my first attempt. Well, this is an important putt for the tournament here, Rich. Certainly is. Let's watch it unfold, Luke. That's pretty tidy. Thanks. Thanks. Nice to hold those for a birdie. And with that... He'll move to eight under par. Take that. Awesome play. Eight under par. Let's see what Morikawa did. Colin Morikawa. Let's see what you got. Currently trailing his rival. Let's see. Well, what the here. fuck kind of view is that, dude? That's the worst camera man of all time. Was it a fucking ground on? Sure. Fucking squirrel got a body cam. This is how the leaderboard. Jesus Christ. Now, Terrible. Dude, Garrick Higo is uh, I guess he's a god. I don't this wonderful par four eight. quite understand. Wonderful only if you're a spectator. It's wonderful if you're not playing it for a lot of cash. It's just one of the most difficult, visually intimidating holes I think you'll ever face in your life. Somehow, try and hit it down the right hand side of the fairway, keep it out of the rough. And from there, hit it out to the right hand side of the green somehow, also keeping it out of the rough or that pot bunker short right. Listen, you'd be happy to make five here. That's for sure. Fours are magnificent. Threes are unicorns. They really don't happen. I need a two, dog. What is that? A difficult, demanding finishing hole. Probably one of the toughest in championship golf. Got to go for it. Come on, that finish line's in sight. That's power to... Oh, my God. Okay. We're clear. We're clear. Wow, that was not a good bounce, though. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that'll work. That's fine. This might be the, final hole at the most important it's shot of the tournament. A very tough shot. But there's just one more to play. There's one final test. The second shot at 18. Water ever so close to the left-hand side. Green has a lot of movement from back to front. Find the right level. Give yourself a decent opportunity to make birdie, but par, never a bad score at the 18th at TBC Sawgrass. Nope. Not going to have the distance on that one. <clears throat> Hoping for a bounce here, preferably to the left. I mean, not the worst, but I needed I needed it closer than that. To win the Players' Championship. Wait, this is to win? Did the other guy bogey? Oh, dude, let me get a putt preview, dog. I'm not going to putt preview it. I'm not going to leave it short, though. I got to go for it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. So close. Looks like this event is going into a playoff. Oh, it's a playoff. Okay, okay. We'll take it. Going to extra holes. Oh, shit. Lowest score takes the win. The player with the lowest score at the end of the aggregate holes will be determined the winner. Let's sit back and watch. 
Oh, so we play three holes. Oh, okay. Holes will be crowned champion. Got it. There's still a tie. It will all come down to a sudden death pile. I'm guessing the sudden death is on the 17th. Feeling pretty good about that one. Yeah, we'll take that shot. Pretty good shot there. Well, this looks enticing here, Rich. Nobody wants to see this player lay up. Time to be bold. I'm down. Up to Missed left that time. Heading towards the rough, this one. Give me a good bounce, though. That's well, not the worst. Time for an errant approach. Missing the green in a playoff puts pressure on the short game. Not the worst. Now give me a little, give me a little break. Oh my that god! Good for a long time. And this take a dirty bird. Lead in the playoff. And as that putt goes down, that will take the lead in this. Oh, he bogeyed that. <laughs> Joke artist. Um, five mile, six mile an hour winds. The tempo there was exquisite. Yeah, it wasn't my best. Well, that was, fantastic. was not my best. From the leader. It's amazing to see how good this player is in full flow. And this part to extend their lead in the playoff. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. God. Is that blood or ice? I don't know, dude. Wow. Wow. This guy's an animal. In the playoff, they got to be feeling great about their chances. Smack that shit. What a lovely position to be in. Holding the lead, playing the last. Good luck. Stay out the rough. Stay out the rough. Oh no! Find it though. Well, I know that we're in the booth and not right up close to it, but it doesn't take a smart person to work out that's not a nice lie. I'm just gonna play it safe. I think it's one more club. I'm almost certain it's one more club. Looks to be <clears throat> with the six iron. Yeah, it's not bad. This is lovely. Yeah, it's not bad. Definitely the right club. That's a lovely shot here at the 18th. And a Appreciate you. For at the last. Nearly doesn't get any better than that. Amazing shot. Give me three birds. This could go in. Three birdies. They Come on. And then some. What a oh, wow, wow, wow. Willie Johnson wins again, back to back. I might be a little bit too good with the, the three click. I might have to up the difficulty a little bit. I don't know. We just won the players championship my first year in the PGA. <laughs> that, uh, that don't seem, that don't seem right. That was fantastic though. I like winning. Winning's fun. All of our sponsors are happy. All right, everybody. I think that's going to do it for this episode of PGA 2K23. I uh, appreciate y'all tuning in. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon, and uh, I'll catch you right back here next time. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have